Um, so this is the video for transitioning to design. <clears throat> so what stood out to me in our, my, the initial intake form was obviously my client was a busy mum. Um, she obviously had major issues with her right shoulder. Um, so that's going to be a big focus rehoping that. Um, in regards to lifestyle factors, under eating was probably her biggest factor. So those were the three things that uh, mainly stood out to me. Lifestyle's busy, shoulder rehab's gonna be a main focus, and she was under eating um, in regards to her food. <clears throat> After going through the initial consult, OPEX body move work assessment, um, my initial noticings was with the scratch test, she had no left to right symmetry. Um, so that was an issue there, and then that carried over to when she'd done the side plank. So her right side was obviously leak, uh, weaker than her left side, not because of her core stability, but because of the shoulder fatigue. Um, so that's a big noticing there. Obviously, you know, unilateral work is going to be a big um, component for her training. Everything else was pretty balanced. Um, <clears throat> transitioning into the design phase, her long term plan is going to be to rehab and strengthen her shoulder. Um, she has clearance from the physio. Obviously, we just have to go by feel in regards to what movements feel good um, and progressing them slowly. With the long-term phases, um, I wanted to do start with a lot of accumulation phases, have the tempos very slow, um, and just accumulating a lot of time on the tension and just building that, that uh, shoulder joint um, and strength slowly. Looking forward, I would just want to challenge those contractions. So obviously, getting a little bit more dynamic, you know, speeding up the tempo, um, and then obviously focusing on increasing her range of motion in that area. Um, in terms of her first short-term plan, um, the main focus is, is obviously improving shoulder health. She likes weightlifting, so positional weightlifting is going to be a big focus first, especially for her clean. Um, we will do some snatch work but then we'll progress just with pulling and then progress into full snatches down the track muscle endurance in that shoulder and upper body and then obviously a lot of unilateral strength development so those were her first um, priorities in her in her training for her lifestyle the only thing we started with she is a super busy person i didn't want to overload her with too much <clears throat> so the main thing that we noticed and spoke about is that she would always skip breakfast so the first thing we added in was a lifestyle reminder to make sure she eats breakfast. And that was the first thing she did every day, <clears throat> or first thing she would do every day, is um, have that reminder set that she makes sure she gets her breakfast in, make sure she gets in some calories, um, and starts her day on, on a good foot, on a good note. Um, and that is it. Thank you.